How did one toxic patient take out an entire hospital wing? On February 19th, 1994, Gloria Ramirez was admitted to Riverside Hospital with palpitations and confusion. Six weeks earlier, she'd been diagnosed with late stage cervical cancer and she was looking very unwell and the emergency team were quite concerned and attached a defibrillator to her chest. The team noticed that there was an oily substance on her chest as well as a strong garlic odor coming from her mouth, but proceeded anyway and applied high flow oxygen. Gloria started to complain of the severe burning of her face and shortly after became unconscious. The weird part though, is that so did the hospital workers one by one after that, whoever came in contact with her. Gloria died shortly after and the first autopsy showed clean toxicology and concluded that it was mass hysteria that made the hospital's 